Life remembered, a Central Falls teacher was killed in a hit and run accident last week. Right now, friends, students, and co-workers of Michael Ochi are gathering for a memorial to honor a man who loved his life and his job. Eyewitness News reporter Alex DePrado joins us live in Central Falls with more on this emotional tribute. Karen, inside the gym, a remembrance to Michael Ochi is underway. Outside, this sign carries a message. You will be missed with a quote from favorite author Emily Dickinson, for love is immortality. At Central Falls High School, 45-year-old Michael Ochi is remembered. When he taught, he, he taught from the heart, and he wanted you to appreciate literature for what it was, and, you know, and like, he was passionate about what he did. Ochi taught English and was the yearbook advisor. Catherine Lopera never had him as a teacher, but considered him a close friend. I took time to listen to him and to see his point of view in life, and he took time to listen to me. And that drew us closer and we created a yearbook that's amazing and I'm going to keep forever. He was different. Walked to the tune of a different drummer, you might say. But nine out of ten, those are your best teachers. Ochi was struck and killed while riding his moped in Little Compton Thursday night. Police say 66-year-old Thomas Fennessy, a former Little Compton teacher, was drunk behind the wheel when he hit Ochi, then took off. Although Ochi's life is over, his love of teaching will live on through his students. He was a great teacher. Um, and above all, he was an amazing friend. Fennessy is out on bond. Con uh, Ochi's funeral is Thursday at 9 a.m. at Connor's Funeral Home in Portsmouth. Live tonight in Central Falls with the Blackstone Valley Mobile Newsroom, I'm Alex DePrado, Eyewitness News.